Hello, I'm Helen Turner from Innovative Safety Solutions. I'm here on behalf of safeworkers.co.uk to talk about manual handling. The definition for manual handling is the movement of anything via the use of bodily force. So that can cover pushing, pulling, dragging and carrying. So a good lifting technique, remember it's not always possible to adopt all these measures. Most important is to stop and think, which always sounds a little bit degrading really, but it's about planning the lift, thinking about where the load is going to. Are you going down steps, up steps, through eight doors, are you walking three miles? two minutes. It's really important just to think about what we're doing. We're all guilty of picking up boxes and bags and just rushing off without really thinking of where we're going. Also, position the feet correctly. Give yourself a good, stable base. Adopt a good posture. You'll have heard the term many times. Don't bend your back bend your knees and again that's still more or less true although we're not quite as obsessed with with not bending your back but keep your back in a nice natural position and remember to bend with your knees to take the weight of that load with the help of the big muscles in your legs get a firm grip really get a good hold on that load then put it down and then adjust it into position. When we're walking and we're moving a load, we need to remember, sounds daft I know, but we need to remember to look where we're going. Always try to avoid twisting when you're carrying because you put pressure on the smaller muscles of the back move with your feet, turn your feet into the direction you want to go. Move obstacles before putting loads down. That really is part of planning the lift in the first place. When lifting to near head height, use an intermediate point to change your grip on the load. Remember your hands need to be in a different place on the load when you're putting it above head height. Think about always using the strongest muscles to move loads. It's pretty obvious and makes good sense. And always consider two-man lifts for heavier items. There's no problem really asking for help with things.